Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Jade Falcon Freeborn. So today we have made our way to Ironhold, finally. Uh, Clan Wolf absolutely detest us, which means at any of their planets we cannot sell or buy anything. So I needed to make sure we had enough sea bills to be able to come here. So we got 4.8 million, I sold a whole bunch of stuff. Um, we had a Clan XL engine, which we picked up in the last mission. Uh, a bunch of old weapons. Uh, extra weapons of a lot of things so we just sold a bunch just to make sure we had enough funds and unfortunately we've only got one jade falcon contract that we can take here so they don't even see us as being uh having any rep because we haven't been here fighting the whole time so they're kind of po'd with us but that's okay we're gonna have to earn our earn our um our reputation back with jade falcons so that's what we're gonna do so today we're gonna take this mission it is against clan wolf um Three skulls should be good hopefully uh, let's just check it out and see what we can do here so let's negotiate we're gonna go for full salvage and accept and let's get rid of the second lance oh yeah be before we actually go any further uh, I can actually show you here too so we pulled out um, the cougar and we put in the white and what I did with the white is I left like the NSS and the XL engine and stuff in uh, we put the four ER medium lasers in here, and we actually were able to add an LRM-10. We have a defense gyro now, too. Um, it's heat neutral, which is great. Uh, TTS weapons, so it's got a bonus chance to hit. The watchdog suite's still in there, so it's hard to see at distances. Um, yeah, so this should be a nice replacement for the Cougar with extra armor. So we were able, able to add one extra weapon system. Now, it is a little slower, but the purpose of this guy is to hang out with the Jenner and fire from longer range. So hopefully that'll be able to do that. Um, and I put the uh, fire starter into uh, storage for now. Okay, so let's get our main lance up. Everybody's hoping that we do well here. And I am too. Kind of excited. Finally get to uh, work on getting Jade Falcon back up. I don't think we'll ever be able to do it because there's so many people fighting for Wolf right now. But uh, let's just have some fun with it. All right, guys, here we go. Ooh, I haven't played on this map in a while. Okay. Might just be one lance. There's sometimes a second lance that comes in from over here. Um, let's move forward. Not necessarily make contact, but get into position. Get into position to make contact. They do have reinforcements. We want to have these guys on this side finished first before we can engage them. Yes, Commander. So three skulls should be good. Hoping for some mediums at least. Yeah, I hear vehicles over here. At least two vehicles. Shadowhawk. Okay, maybe it's a two C. It's reserve. And reserve. They may not be able to see us, so. Hearing vehicles over there. Two Shadowhawks, eh? Standing by. We want to start this? I think we do. I think we want to start this. I think we want to get right on these guys. Thank you. Okay, Griffin. Nice. And a Stormcrow. Okay. Let's get some Stormcrow parts this time. Fire on this guy. And... Um, CT's been hit. Let's just fire. He's braced in the woods, so I mean, there's not much chance of us doing a lot of damage to him. Good to go. Well, it's a good start anyway. Fire it all. Good. My 
right way. I think we have a lower chance to hit this guy. He moved, right? Yeah. So let's hammer this guy. Um, uh, yep, firing. Okay, we panned with one of them. Scored a critical hit. Leg hit. It's hoping for a CT. Ooh, how hardcore do I want to get with these guys? Probably not that hardcore. Still can't see him, eh? All right, hammering him. Going down. Yep. Commander. Put that girl in the trees. There he is. CT him, please. Firing. So the goal is to use this hill here to protect us from any vehicles on this side firing at long range. If we can pull the Shadowhawk down, we can go after the Griffin. I think we got some room to move around here. Yeah, we do. Another Shadowhawk coming in. They're capable of pulling out a lot of damage, so we just want to make sure we can... Uh-huh. I want to make sure we can pull a lot of uh, these guys down fast. Stormcrow I'd like to get pieces of. We do have a bunch, so... Got to hit the guy on the ground here. You cheeky monkey, you're blocking him. Get right on him. There we go. Ultra 10 showing its worth. That one's gone. Nice. Uh-huh. Thinking twice and I don't blame you. Gonna okay, fire on this guy and unload. Nicely done. Pona. He'll be up on us pretty quick. Two more turns and he'll be up here. He'll be an attack of opportunity. If we see him in the open, we'll probably take him down. What do you need? need you on this side, please. Okay. Um... Yeah, let's um go like this. That hit something good. If we can put this guy on the ground. Get in the gully down here. Gonna do the same thing. There we go. Now we can hopefully finish him up with some more leg shots on the other side. Enemy mech. Critical damage detected. Ready for orders. These guys have gotten soft fighting uh, the uh, Jade Falcon Trueborns, thinking that when these Freeborns show up, they're going to be able to take us out without a problem. Surprise. Uh, how much you got in this torso here? A lot more in the leg. Yeah, maybe not. Let's go after the leg. Let's do it. Still got our sharpshooter left.
Okay, the griffin will be after this guy. Standing by. Okay, shooter of sharpness. I'm there. Super sharp shooter shooting shots. Fire. Okay, both legs gone. Hope we can salvage that. Oh, I'm sure we can. Both you and Blockade are crack shots, so... Oh, we got another mech back here. Finally, somebody else getting the 0.9% chance to hit. Stormcrow. Nice! Finally, a good battle. Oh, yeah, no, I, I, uh, I'm, I'm just kidding, man. Don't shoot those auto cannons at me. <laughs> it's probably at least a 10. Can't have a lot of armor, though. 850. It's still, that's still respectable. 90 in the legs. For 55 tons, he should have 35, or 130, but... Got 90 in the legs, eh? Alright, firing. That's a lot of leg hits. There it goes. Finding our medium laser hit, though, with 30 damage. And fire. Ooh, really? Okay. Yeah. All right. Okay. Okay. As Rolo from Frankenstein's lab says, okay, okay, okay. Let's shoot this leg up. I wonder if it's just these two. Not much else firing back there. Waiting for orders. Just copy that. Hmm. I know we don't really need to use Warlord on this, but the extra chance to hit. I want to make sure we try and take that leg. Nope, not enough. Really? Was it got like one left? Nope. Well, it's gone next turn anyway. There's another vehicle back there. I heard it moving. So they got to have four units over there, probably. Thanks for coming out, buddy. Thanks for showing up for the battle. Leave that off. Firing. Enemy mech. Critical damage detected. Okay. Commander. Coordinates received. I know we're fighting from in a valley, but we really need to. Um, Stay away from direct fire from those other vehicles. Yes, Commander. Heading out. Yes. 
Okay, there's the legs off that one. Blockade should easily be able to take the leg off this guy. ATM's coming in, whole lot of nothing. So we're going to push that opponent next turn. Aye, aye. Let's get into a position here. Didn't pick up anything else. Don't think we need the large, but we're going to fire the rest of the leg here. There we go. Okay, four down. Four to go. Hopefully four. Got a lock on. Yeah, there's another vehicle back there doing sensor locking. Dump it all into him. Wow, man. Accuracy on her is crazy sometimes. I'll leave the Ultra 20 off. We don't need it, I don't think, on this one. Well, with 99% chance, why not? Or Ultra 10, sorry, not 20. Okay, Griff. No need to reveal ourselves, just get into the trees here. Good to go. Uh, I want to use vigilance, I don't think so. I'll just move up here. Got it. Go up to the leg, firing. Ooh, look at look, the three hits in the leg there. Could be, I don't know. Maybe it was. Oh, what do we got here? Oh, ooh, ooh, more salvage. Catapult. We've got catapult parts as well. I don't know what to take now. You're making it confusing for me. Stop. Yeah, it looks like we did get three hits in that leg. There goes the leg. He's going down. I just want to walk up. I want to give us the best chance to hit. That's probably enough. Nope. I thought it was. Ooh, he's got PPCs. Evil. Nope. Attack. This guy. Leg. No ultra. And firing. Really? There's that vehicle. Come on. <sighs> Should have been able to get that leg. I love the insane movement speed on Griff. It's, it's just amazing. Zora, let's see if we can pull him out of the battle. Uh, I'm going to use Warlord. Give us a bit better chance to hit. A little bit of extra damage. That should be enough. Okay. Now he won't be spotting us anymore. Claim the leg. There it is. 
They just got the crap pult left. He's a direct fire mech, so um Well he's gonna move forward probably. No. Waiting for orders. It's a lot of armor. Let's see if we can suit the leg. Wow, that was a lot of damage. Nicely done. Ready for orders. Solid blue, nice. Ultra 10, Warlord, confirm. Offensive push, going after the leg, fire. This guy should be back enough that all of us should go before him. Uh, yeah, fired all in the leg. Orders. Let's try for it. Nicely done. I think I hit something good. I think you did too. See if you can claim the other leg here. Now I know we can't choose the salvage, but it'll put it on the loot table anyway, give us the best chance for the draw. Confirm. God, his torso's almost gone, eh? Still want this leg though. Um, let's give ourselves a better chance to hit. Might as well take it now. Firing. Yeah. Well, you tried. Standing by. What do you think, bird? Rolling. Take that leg. All weapons are go. There you go. I need a new target. There we go, folks. Mission successful. Well, the Trueborn were wondering where the hell we were. We were out honing our skills so we could come back and do stuff like that. That was a really good mission. Look at this, almost no damage at all. Barely any hits. That was, a, it couldn't have been a better map. I think that was a, a good map and evenly distributed kills here. Let's see what we get, come on. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. We just hard rock that. Now, Stormcrow D. It's got LRM 20 launchers backed up by SRM 2 launchers. And the B has got close combat configuration 12, 14, 11, 11, 16, 11. I think I like the D better. Uh, I'm not even going to look down below. Um, I'm going to grab three of these, see if we can get some more. So we've got a Griffin part, two Shadowhawk, two C parts, one B part, one, two, three. three. Ah, we only got four parts. Okay, well, could have been worse. Medium pulse, we got lots of those anyway. Guardian ECM. So, good mech parts, that's for sure. Okay, words are still taking planets from Ghost Bear, eh? 22,000 repairs is nothing. Let's quickly have a look and see what the flip value of that was, if it was anything. Nothing. Nothing. Because there's no border planets, I guess. 
But at least we were able to take Jade Falcon missions, so that was good. Is there anything repopulated? Probably not. Let's have a look. Nope. So there's nothing else we can do here right away. Pretty soon we'll be taking a higher skull one. So they had two, three missions on this planet we could have taken. That was a three skull. That was probably... We could probably push three and a half if we have more missions like that one. Um, depending on the terrain, what we're fighting against, that was actually pretty, I don't want to say easy, but uh, relatively simple. We didn't get the Stormcrow, unfortunately. I think we're just one part short. Uh, let's have a look at um, Star Map. So we've got, what's the closest jump point here? And that's nine days to Huntress and back. Or 18 days there and back. 13. Don't think there's anything any closer. 10 days to Shadow. Huntress is a half skull. Nine days, so 18 days to get back. It's way too long. Uh... Let's just go for the short run. We can go here and back. It's going to cost us a uh, financial report, but that's fine. You notice how blue that planet was? You notice how blue and amazing that planet is? Because it's Jade Falcon, right? It's just so awesome. Wolf planets are all dingy and dark. They're like, they're like warg pens or something. Jade Falcon's got beautiful skies, beautiful water just because we're awesome. Alright, let's have a look. Can't go to the store, obviously. Um, contracts. Probably nothing here, really. I mean, all we can really do now is take, like, half-skull contracts for Clan Wolf. Okay, so this is Ghost Bear Homeworld. We probably want to get some up, or not Ghost Bear, sorry. Um, uh, yeah, Smoke Jaguar, sorry. I was thinking Shadow something, but yeah, Smoke Jaguar. Uh, just to go break down. Yeah, let's go back. Um, that is why we came all, all this way. We got, we've got the sea bills for it, so let's go back. See if we can pick up another Jade Falcon mission finish this episode up. Kind of really excited about that. Let's throw a party in the lounge, man. Of course. El Duce's got high spirits. Morale increased by one. So our morale is like pretty awesome right now. 28. Just kind of glad to have it up in the, uh, the high levels. I guess basically all we're doing is doing hit and run tactic tactics here. So the good thing about having that ghost bearer planet right next to us is we can jump in there, um, pull off a couple of missions, pick up some XL engines, and then jump back to uh, Diamond Shark space. All right, let's have a look. Fingers crossed. Yep, another one. Excellent. Okay, let's have a look at the barracks first before we go into that one. Okay, blockade. All right, finally got piloting eight extra evasion. El Duce picked that up a little before this episode started, so he's awesome. Still Griff and uh, Mockingbird to go, but we're pretty darn close to getting that. And I'm not really worried about the rest of these guys. They're all working towards gunnery now, with the exception of Six Pack, who needs to pick up Guts, and Sundance, who needs to pick up Guts first. Hannibal the Cannibal. Okay, so let's have a look for contracts. See if there's more than one. Nope, we got one. That's fine. Burden of Proof. Three skulls. Ambush a convoy in the jungle. We can do that. Against Clan Wolf. Excellent. Okay, let's deploy and get this done. Okay. Jungle Ambush Convoy.
I think this is the first time I've actually done an ambush convoy on this map. I guess they're headed out that way, coming from here. Um, sure. Receiving you. Luce. Just want to make sure we get right in front of that convoy. I hate the fact that you can click on your left click on your units like that when you have another unit selected. Because you can't do anything with this guy. I guess just to check the stats, but you should be right clicking on him for that, but whatever. Whatever. Copy that, Commander. Okay, they're coming from here. Uh, you can fire a maneuver, so our target is within sensor range. Ooh, what do we got here? Night gear, that's 75, right? If I'm not mistaken. You got fire and maneuver. All right, full speed. Ooh, okay. Stormcrow Prime with almost no armor. Mad Cat. We got. Oh, we need is two parts of a Mad Cat. One part of a Stormcrow. We could have two new mechs. I don't like this. Uh, I'm firing. Reporting critical hit. Mmm. Don't like this. Oh no, sir. I don't like it. Oh boy. Okay, I got the leg. Enemy mech. Critical damage detected. Damn it. I don't have blockade finish up my attack. There's just no point in uh, knocking that guy down. Okay, moving over here. Uh, my other thought was to bring blockade around to to shoot at this guy to make him run away, but won't happen. So um, targeting for now. Oh my God, we got both legs. Okay, we want Mad Cat parts. As long as we get, we need two Mad Cats. I think we only need one Storm Crow. Okay, guys, what are you doing? Okay, so that's all the guards. Now the vehicle's got to move. Yeah. Oh, they're racking up the sensor locks. Three, four. Oh, you tricky buggers, you. They've heard about us.
Hundred ton. Orders. Okay, and then <sighs> gotta move away from that Mars assault vehicle. Uh, let's target. We don't have much of this left. Mm, I think we only need one piece of storm crow, so let's just fire straight at it. We'll get what we get out of it. So we took a good chunk of leg off, good chunk of arm missing. Okay, just fire at this guy. He going? No, he's not going first. Mad Cat. Meh. Standing by. Okay, you can't target him, so. Um, yeah, let's push the CT. We gotta get him off the field. Enemy Worried about that Mars assault vehicle now. I think if we all crest the hill and attack him at one time, should be able to pull him down, but we got at least a turn before he gets up here. Yeah. Did you see him bump over that, <laughs> run underneath the mech, the mech moved? Roger that. Standing by. That Mars assault vehicle's got a couple of turns before it crests the hill. So let's hope, yep, Mad Cat's coming in. No? Yeah? No? Nope. They just got so many people that can sensor lock now. Cannot be out in the open. Uh, that's the right side, which is where we're damaged. Full throttle. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Nice. One less sensor locker. Let's reserve. I think I want the Mars vehicle to go first. Ah, he's got the Gauss rifle. Uh, let's reserve. Got 
Okay, they're finally shooting. Affirmative. I copy. I want to try and get everyone to go twice. Or just about everybody to go twice. For the Mars Assault vehicle. That looks like a shit ton of armor. Good to go. Yeah. Bartle. Here it comes. Commander. Bartle. Target four. Out of sight. Yes, Commander. Let's hope we make short work of this guy. On it. Let's get the ultra on him, firing. Mostly got the other side in the front, eh? Okay, firing. That should be it. Nicely done. Walking back somewhere. Ooh, good shooting, man. Do they think they can hurt me? Dude, aye, aye. just don't, don't even say it. Firing. Ooh, one shot kill. Dude, you murdered that guy. Whoa, they're really loving me. Warning. Armor breached. Internal damage. I know, I'm feeling it. Ready for orders. Right. Nicely done. Yeah, man. Not enough, but that's okay. Kind of seventy eight on that side, eh? Okay, firing. Commander. Copy this that. should be enough right here. All yep. No, no, it's fine. You can come here and get us. We just got to pick up a few more Mad Cat parts and we're ready yeah. to go. Look at that. 
Okay. Yeah, let's do this. I think we should leave the ultra off. Go after the leg. Fire. Just worried about blowing right through the torso and everything. Acknowledged. Okay, right leg. Reporting critical hit. Now let's just see if we can get that left leg. We could pick up two mechs here, guys. Could. I really want the mad cat though. I got a pair of LRM 20s waiting for this guy. Waiting for orders. Nowhere we can get blue on this side, eh? Okay, well. Rolling. Sweep the leg. Nicely done. I need a new target. Mission successful. Okay, contract payment increased by twenty five percent, two hundred eight thousand. I don't know how much this we're going to use. Probably like seventy thousand in repairs. Took a lot on the uh, Stormcrow here. Don't think we got any crits on us though. Nope, we're okay. Um, yeah, so that was pretty good overall. The Nova took a hit in the arm here, but we're all right, so. Now the mech parts, that's what I want. Let's see what we got here. Okay, two Mad Cat parts. There's our Mad Cat, and let's take the Stormcrow part. Let's hope that's enough. Lots of night gear parts, but it's, I know it's 75 tons, but we have a better chance of picking these guys up. Which means we can move up in weight class and get these guys anyway. Alright, so I'm not even going to look below. Okay, three Mad Cat parts, which is excellent. Now, two Night Gear parts. That's excellent as well. A couple of LRM-20s. Ultra 5. Okay. So we picked up some pretty good stuff here. Okay, so there's the Stormcrow D. Two LRM-20 launchers. And there's the Mad Cat. All right, guys, we just picked up two mechs twice in two episodes. 78,000. Oh, my God, that was really good. Now we just have to decide what mechs we're going to keep and what ones we're going to get rid of. Let's have a look at them real quick before we end this episode. Probably won't outfit them yet, but uh, we'll have a look. There's the Mad Cat. Let's have a look at this guy. Looks like it kept the head stuff. Now we got the Artemis system and that's it, eh? Wow. We got nothing out of this guy. Oh, we got Pharaoh. And the Artemis. Okay, well... Sure. 525,000 in 10 days. Let's confirm that. Wow, it looks like we can install our own core in this too. Alright, what else do we got here? Right. Come on. I'll get it in the Stormcrow. Got the endo steel. Come on, refit. So we kept the endo steel. What else do we keep here? Not much. Endo steel pharaoh. Oh, we got the LRM 20. Follow the leader ammo. Okay. Narc beacon improved. That's interesting. Clan double heat sink kit. So we made out okay on this guy. Uh, plenty of. Like, plenty of uh, hard points on this guy for just whatever we want to do with him. Yeah, really nice. Okay, let's confirm this. So we'll have a couple of new mechs to outfit in the upcoming episodes. Um, I probably want to do a few more um, bouncing back and forth uh, between... Um, 
Iron Hold, and what's the other place over here? It's the Smoke Jaguar World. Yeah, we're not going to do. We're not going to be getting anything for these guys. Uh, not until somebody else can flip some worlds that are near this. Like we have to flip. We'd have to flip this world. Or one of, one of these worlds. Not that one, but this one probably. In order to be able to flip this one. It's not an easy task, that's for sure. But, uh, yeah, so we're going to be going back and forth between uh, Huntress. Probably take a Lowlands mission there. And then come back here. And uh, take some more Jade Falcon. So as soon as our rep gets a little higher with Jade Falcon, um, that'll be good. I think we're at 18 now. Should be able to take some higher lance missions now that we have uh where we got we're good with diamond shark um where are you there you are at what oh we're at just at 19 now okay they're indifferent still so we should be able to pull ahead next episode um which will be good um i don't think jade falcon's going to be making it out of the doghouse anytime soon but uh, we'll work towards that anyway all right, so we're going to leave the episode for now. Um, I'll probably jump back to uh, Huntress. So the next time we start, we will be um, taking probably a uh, Smoke Jaguar mission on Huntress. Then we'll come back here and take another uh, Jade Falcon mission on, on Ironhold. All right, so if you like the episode, drop a like. If you didn't, sub if you haven't subscribed or if you, have, if you didn't subscribe, uh, please feel free please feel free to subscribe and drop any comments in the comment section down below. And until next time, we'll see you later.